Okay, folks, so. Oh, what? junky car. I can't even turn up a light. I was in bed, you know, about ready to call it a night. And Lucy has barges into my room and says, We're going to Taco Bell. And I'm just like, it's just a lot, you know? It's just a lot to handle. But I suppose since we're here, we're gonna try the grilled cheese burrito. One second, please. Can I get two grilled cheese burritos, please? Okay. And ask if they have the uh, nacho fries. Do you still have the nacho fries? No, uh, no, we don't have those. That is such okay. an L. Seeing what that grilled cheese burrito is, we are absolutely not eating that in my car. Did you see? There is arroz, queso, pan, E. We love a bilingual king. <laughs> YouTube, if you're gonna be a vlogger, be a vlogger that actually looks at the audience. Don't be one of those that are like, hey, what's up, you guys, and always looking at yourself in so the viewfinder. Ugly. It's usually the TikTokers that have turned into YouTubers, and so they're always just looking at themselves. Why are you trying to out hood or Lil Huddy like that, Lucy? Don't talk about my best friend like that. Lil Listen, Huddy? Don't talk about my best friend Lil like Huddy? that. Lil Huddy? No, no, no. <laughs> my little brother. Don't you talk don't about my little you're brother not, like you're not that. Call Lil Huddy your little bro. I have a half black little brother. Shut up. <laughs> We touched fingers and I had to her. I think I felt something. You haven't oh, felt it. Yeah, that's embarrassing. What is that? What is going on? Oh, I need to go. move out of it. I need to move yes. out of this state now. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Who, who even is that? Yeah. Do we know? Tequila. Look it's at all tequila. the sauce you got. You guys like mm -hmm. way too much sauce. Yeah. Keep my music. I got the sauce. I got the cheese. I got the sauce. I got the cheese. Sprinkle no meat. So we went to Taco Bell because you know thinness. It's literally 10 o'clock on a Thursday night. There's no reason this needed to happen. So I've been seeing all over TikTok that um, Taco Bell came out with a grilled cheese burrito. Oh. She thick though. She thick though. Wait. The grease is real. It's literally like wet. We're gonna do a bite and three, two. Wait, hold on, I'm trying to do this without getting any grease on me. Okay. This is what mine looks like, everybody. Um, my mouth is watering. Let's get, let's do this okay. thing. No. Mm. It's the best thing I've eaten all day. You haven't eaten yet, have you? They had a frozen dinner for lunch. Oh, we love when he's a gourmet chef. Oh, there we go. Okay, what are the like the yeah. red things? I think they're like hot Fritos. Really? It just adds a little bit of crunch. If anyone hasn't heard of Taco Bell's mild sauce, <laughs> <laughs> it's a hidden gem. It's not hidden. I tried it for the first time two weeks ago. Casey, who's in the garage right now, uh, showed that to me. And he's coming maybe to join. Casey, look at this burrito. I went down the Spanish aisle. Yeah. That's the aisle? The Spanish aisle? No. The Hispanic, Hispanic aisle. Sorry. Sorry. Cut that out, I guess. I'm trying to be politically I'm tr I'm Or trying. just like a somewhat intelligent person. Typical white person. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I did learn Casey, the other how week. about you hop in the trunk? Join the vid. Join the vid. <laughs> Get in the backseat. Get in the backseat. You know, do you hear there's a war on Gandhi now? People are canceling Gandhi. <laughs> okay, so Who this goes- Who cancels no, Gandhi? No, this, this goes- There's a lot of negativity out there trying to spread positivity. Wow. I didn't word that really He quite. thought he did No, something. but the, Yeah, that makes almost no sense. Okay, okay. <laughs> but yeah, there's a lot of people like trying to spread positivity, but they're doing it in a negative way. Yeah. By like canceling everybody and just shaming everybody instead of being like, hey, this could be a learning moment. Instead it's like, no, let's dig up something from 47 years ago mm -hmm. that you did wrong, therefore you're a bad person. Just the one thing that they did. Or multiple things, if you're Shane Dawson. Well, Casey, how are we? We're doing good, we're 4 and 0. Damn I it, was not asking game. about your wiffle ball stats. You asked how I was. I so know, I'm but just gonna be is that your entire personality? No. Your wiffle ball? I'm game? okay with that if that's an entire personality. <laughs> your wiffle ball stats? Like, hmm. Your entire personality is quoting TikTok, so don't talk. <laughs> and TikTok's about to be canceled, so yeah, I'm so going to go back you're gonna to go, have you're gonna be you, mute. you just spit on my yeah. thigh. I'm going to puke. <laughs> Yuck. That's COVID. <laughs> It's a piece of COVID in the car right now. <laughs> it's walking around. <laughs> are they, uh, are the second round coming out? I'm not getting, an, I didn't get the Wait. first one of the stimulus. I heard that was a thing. No, you're, cause you're still living with your parents. Shut up. They're dependents. I'm just telling the truth. Oh, that rent free living. I'm pretty sure if you were to move like one house next door, you probably would have got it. No, I don't think, cause I could live not with my parents and still be a dependent. What age did you move out, Casey? Uh, when did I go to college? And you never moved home afterwards? No, I'm back. I moved back for about two plus years. Maggie moved back for about six. She's 
going to be the wealthiest out of all of us. Very much so, and she's marrying another doctor, so things aren't exactly going to be tight around there. I made the wrong decision. <laughs> <laughs> you should have hopped on that years ago. Yeah. So, Casey, was there ever a moment of time when you looked at me and thought, that's it, that's wifey? <laughs> Do I have to answer that? Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You set yourself up, you knew the answer to that. I'm pretty sure with us growing up together, it never happened. Yeah, because you were like, Four when it's, he was in high school. It's a miracle we get along now because oh, I remember. You, you hated each other. I remember yeah. um, vividly standing at the edge of this driveway and telling your parents that you bully me and harass me. <laughs> and I was about nine. You were also kind of a bee. <laughs> you were calling me a bee for, since like age six on. Okay, so what are your plans for this weekend? This weekend, I'm going golfing tomorrow. Where? Uh, somewhere in St. Paul. Can I come? What time are we doing that? Are you paying? <laughs> what time? Right after work, if you want to walk the course. I can't play? Can I drive the golf cart alongside? Probably could. Wait, do you have a golf cart? Yeah, we're getting cars. Shut up, can I actually come? I've oh. always wanted to drive a golf cart. What is the state of the toilet after I was Taco just about Bell to ask, is this going to be bad for me later? Yeah, it's not going to be good. Please so, use your own. You, so just, I just, you just cleaned ours. Yeah, yes. I just cleaned How your was toilet. the bathroom? Awful. Okay, I should rephrase that. There was a couple awful aspects, like but what? overall it was Like human awful. feces? Someone missed the toilet taking a dump. It is gonna throw yeah. up. And then it hardened. He missed, <laughs> and he missed it by about three days of cleaning. Mm -hmm. And so I had to put my mask on so I didn't actually... Shut up, you were no, afraid. I was afraid there was gonna be things that would flick into my mouth. Yeah. I'm actually gonna gag. Yeah. I'm so dumb. And then I tried scraping it off and didn't come off with just the toilet scraper. So I had to literally put my back into it <laughs> for about two, three minutes in order to get it off. That's a picture I sent Casey. Eh. He's wearing the mask. That's oh. actually. You, you, that's at your new Tinder pick. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why would I use that? How's everyone's dating life going? I hadn't finished my story. Look, but still okay. in the middle of it. Mm. I know, I got tired of it though. Okay. Casey, how's your love life going? You know, I'm I'm doing really bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best answer I've ever heard. That's so good. <laughs> it's either it's usually like, ah, oh, not so hot right now, mm. or it's like a little slow, but you know, I'm doing really Mine's bad. Mine's never been worse. <laughs> I can I can honestly say it has never been worse. I haven't spoken to a woman in 13 months. <laughs> <laughs> I had to sneak her over. Why? I had to, because she never wanted to hang out. You have to believe out her name. Yeah. Um, she would never hang out with a group. Like she only wanted to hang out one on one, one on one. And so in order she to was get embarrassed her, of you? I didn't ask why. I never Likely. brought it up. But in order to get her to meet my friends, I had to trick her into saying we were just like hanging out one on one. And then, whoops, surprise! There's other people. <laughs> I think the second time I met her, we Luke and I were in an intense knee hockey battle. <laughs> oh gosh! And she just sat on the couch really awkwardly. Oh my gosh! She was nice that like she just watched and she's like, yeah. no, finish your game, finish yeah. your game, and she wasn't like, oh wow. I would have been like, wrap it the hell up, let's go get food. So are you on the, any swiping apps, Casey? Juan. Uh, button ball. Yes. Have you ever seen me? No, I don't go that low. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean age or looks? Yes. <laughs> Did you know what Casey and I are gonna drop soon? What? I don't even want to know. I yeah. don't even want to know. We're gonna drop. Can we a, plug? Can we plug it? Right yeah, now? yeah. yeah, yeah. It. We're gonna drop a gaming channel. No, but I. But it's but it's backyard baseball streaming. Why is that gonna be so successful? Wait, stay tuned to Morbid Five. The channel will be resurrected. First video in probably over a year. Oh Pablo yeah. Pablo Sanchez is Bay. Like honestly, that dude could dude get it. Feel... Does he usually speak Spanish? Yeah, he only speaks Spanish. But unless you a do man a after code. my own heart. What using men for money is that is that <laughs> frowned upon? It is in my book. <laughs> Casey would smell that from a mile At away. At what point do you Bitch, think you don't have your own money? <laughs> <laughs> Bye. At what point do you think you're gonna give up on trying to further your career and just try and be a hot wife? Okay, sorry, a wife. Yeah, that's so <laughs> rude. Come down to is getting a man. I realize I I like can't hold a man. So, just, so is can't. it your style? Is it who you pick? I think it's just my personality. It's just kind of everything about it. Yeah, you. everything's working against me in terms of you know mating. It's fine. Is that how we put it? I just like to tell myself I'm intimidating. 
I've told myself that for a couple years. Okay. <laughs> and then eventually I realized it wasn't there. Oh, but you know it that did help. It did help for a couple years. <laughs> Who's not intimidating? Lucy or I? Luke. Both. Am I intimidating? I think you could come on strong. Yes. Why? Just because I'm not shy? Yes. Hmm. You, but you, you don't have any filter on that mouth. But you only <laughs> you only do that around my friend, like around other guys that aren't my friends you don't come across that what way. guys that's true you've never spoken yeah I'm like, and I'm not exactly like getting a like a proposal from any of your friends so oh, hell no yeah and so it's like I think we're all intimidated by Luke by that really well, that's why I'm intimidated why would Luke right. be intimidated to, to guy friends not to girls why no it's a joke oh I was like Lucius because would... you're the little sister Luke's the big brother it was the joke I feel like I Lucius guess. would be the least intimidating like older brother no I think Luke once put it, oh, that would be great. What? Just having a friend marrying to the fan. Oh, yeah. I feel like that would be best case scenario. It's too bad you don't have any attractive friends. <laughs> In case he just leaves his <laughs> car. <laughs> he just unbuckles I, he silently. Made, he made like, it clear. I told you it was bad. I'm curious how we have three orange cones in our garage. Yeah, where did they come from? Two from me. <laughs> okay. Casey! <laughs> so, uh, what? I got really drunk at short stops. <laughs> that junky bar up there? Over there in Fridley? Yeah. Where I could just like literally take an Uber ride home for like three bucks. Seriously? Yeah. I've never been there. Food good? I got really drunk. <laughs> and I saw a cone. I was like, oh, that's cool. So waiting for the Uber, I just got the cone and threw it into the back of my trunk. In the Uber? No, in my car. Oh, and then, okay. The next day. You... Yeah, and the next day I'm driving <laughs> home and I'm like, what the f is this orange thing reflecting off my trunk. I texted my buddy, I was like, why is there a cone in my car? <laughs> I'm was, pretty sure that's like a misdemeanor because it's federal property. I um, asked my buddy who works for the city, he goes, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> but why is that a thing? I feel like you're not the only one that does that. Steals when stuff? When you, well, steal specifically orange traffic cones oh, when you get you, drunk. You know that rubber duck sign, right? Yes, <laughs> that thing's massive. Uh, we might have taken that off of a North Dakota road. Oh my that gosh. Was, it was actually bolted up. Oh and no. And we actually took it down. And then we were gonna go back and take the second one a week later, and that one was down. So I'm pretty sure somebody who ever bought it just took it down so that we couldn't take Wait, it. Wait, so they had a sign to warn for people that ducks cross there? Must have yeah. been a joke. Or was it actually? No, it was ponds on both sides. Oh my gosh. But it's, wow. it's not an actual, that sign isn't actually a state sign because it doesn't have anything on the back of it. So somebody literally bought that sign to put up there. To save the ducklings. Yeah. That is so cute. Aw, murderer. Do you sleep well at night? Yeah, I was like, Seeing how do you... that hanging in the hallway? Knowing that you probably murdered multiple ducklings because of it? Indirectly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, this has been nice. All right, folks, so I think what we can take from this video is that um, there won't be any reproduction happening coming from this group in probably 20 years. Wait, in 20 years you said no reproduction? It's not looking good. It says I didn't donate.